Our team consists of four unique roles. Starting with Hamza. Hamza was responsible for our UI, where he used React to make sure our website stays interactive. Next, we go on to Elsa. Elsa was responsible for our design, where she used Adobe XD to ensure that our website stays user-friendly. Following up is Hallie. Hallie was responsible for our backend, where she built the API using Node.js to ensure that our website has smooth data flow. Next was me. I was responsible for the data storage, where I built our database using Azure MySQL, which has world-class security, so you don't have to worry about your data getting stolen. Now let's talk about our origin story. We decided to take inspiration from the selling application OfferUp. As students, we know that when you try to sell your books back to the bookstore, it is very likely that you'll get less than what you paid for it. We've also seen that some textbooks will only come brand new, which limits our choices to buy them with high prices. Taking inspiration from OfferUp, we wanted to create an application that would offer students an opportunity to buy and sell books exclusively to each other, rather than just the bookstore. With College Biblio, students would also get some money back when buying and selling their books. Now, we're going to watch the walkthrough narrated by Hamza. Thanks, Ed. All right, so I'm going to show you guys how to sell a book on College Biblio. So, we're going to sign in first. And as you can see, I'm already signed in uh, before. So I'm going to use my uh, Arizona.id, uh, .edu, sorry, uh, email, because we only accept uh, student email. So you have to use your uh, school emails. Otherwise, um, you cannot log in. So I'm going to put all my information here and push as well. Awesome. So now we are going to sell a book. So we can click this sell book and we have to put in the ISB number, ISBN number, the 13 digits. So I'm going to sell this book right here, the dummies book, and we'll grab that uh, ISBN number. I'm going to put it in and boom, right? All the information that we need and the photos. So as of, right, as of now, uh, we don't have a way for us to grab the, you know, uh, for the users to upload their images uh, when they're selling, uh, but that's going to be the next feature that we're going to implement. So as of now, we're only going to use this uh, pictures that we generate from other third party uh, APIs. So we're going to say the quality of our book is good. Uh, say as a new, better, uh, you know, it sounds better that way. And we know that the Amazon sells for $18.99. So that's what we're going to keep that in mind. Uh, so the class ID will be 317 CSC 317. I just pick random. I mean, that's the class that I took before. So, um, and then 1899, right? Sweet. So when we click submit, then you'll take you back to the homepage and you can see your book right here. Sorry. So, and then, you know, that's the users, right? That's the seller, right? Basically, and me. And when um, the buyer wants to buy this book, right? They can quickly just click on this context seller. And what's going to happen, it's going to redirect them to group me. And as of now, we're going to use group me uh, only. And users can, you know, log in and, and grab that email of the seller and then put that email in there and start, you know, conversation and the transaction will later on take place. So, all right. Thank you guys. And hope you like it. Wow. That was amazing, Hamza. And thank you guys at home for watching. I hope to see all you guys soon on the College Biblio platform. Thank you.